Hello everybody, welcome back to Night Ghost 49. Welcome back to Banished. We've got Nomadia, our second version or village of this. Um, and before we get going, I'd like to apologize for the rather large interruption of recordings. I had some pretty serious family issues come up. I'm not going to get into them in this video, but that's why. Uh, some, some people posted a bit of either just missing the series or a bit of frustration, which is understandable. Um, I'm glad to know how you guys feel about it, but that's kind of how it was. If you follow me on Twitter, I was a little bit more open about those kind of things, and then I talked about it in the live stream this last Saturday. So, um, just FYI, I, I tried to open up there a little bit more because people were concerned. Anyway, um, everything's fine, but we're, uh, we're, we're working through some stuff uh, as the family. So, anyway, I just want to let you guys know that's why. Also, if you hear any notifications like beeping or buzzing... Uh, that comes up. My phone is on alert because I am um, I am on duty, as you could say, for uh, taking care of wife ghost. So she's just right upstairs. Anyway, that's what's going on. So normally I try to silence that and make sure it's not a big issue, but uh, that's what's that's what's happening. So let's go ahead and jump into this. Now it's been several days, like it's almost seven now. It's been seven days since I've touched this. And I want to go ahead and look over the overview real quick. Let's look at our production and then push from there because I know that we're working on some different industries and trying to get those up and running. But I want to make sure I'm not behind on families. Now, currently we have 37 families. Why did it do that? Again, I'm still having these graphical weird issues where something will pop up behind an application, behind like a program. And in this, this case with uh, Banished, it actually acts as though I alt tabbed, which makes me concerned. I've been like checking my computer. Anyway. Um, we have 37 families. We have 39 homes. We actually have more homes than families. I think we hit a bit of a lull if we look at uh, population over the last 10 years. No, no, we didn't. We just got, um, well, either way, I don't, I don't think I was on top of the population when it came to kids and kids going to school and stuff like that. So I, th I think that's a little messed up right now, and I've built more homes than I need, which I don't like being in that situation because pairing tends to be weird when you do that. Let's go to production here. We're overproducing by about 7,000 food, which is good it's comfortable for now with the size that we're at but we're going to want to keep amping that up even more we're making more tools than we need which i'm really happy about same thing with fuel not so much with iron because we've been cranking away on the tools so much but i'm not too concerned because we're just on, well we're at 450 essentially for iron stone um, i'm using a ton of stone it's because i've built a lot of things recently whatever we're going to deal with that it's not a big deal i would like to start making the um making the roads a little bit better. I might do that with brick this time. You know what? Let's do that with brick this time. I'm serious. Let's not use stone at all. Let's just use brick and make it look good. And then logs, we're a little behind on that. But again, that's because we hit the limit. It keeps bouncing back and forth. So not not super concerning. Our food is just do, 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 going up and up and up. We're just under 70,000. I'm really happy about that. Um, I would like to check. I'll go ahead and unpause things while we're doing this on our brick. Where are we at with that? Cherry... Are we not doing brick? Are we doing uh, sand, glass, lumber, and iron? Well, there you go. I would I would like to start making brick. Um, I, I really would, actually. That sounds amazing. Let's go ahead and, oh gosh, I'm having to remember. I'm, I'm having a bit of a weird like lag here on my, on my keystrokes. Um, stacks burner, one and two. We'll go ahead and do that. And then we've got sand here and only one and one. How are we doing on sand and glass? Let's check that in industry real quick. So I'm not I'm not gonna mess with the food for the moment. I want to get into some industry a little bit. Fuel furnace fuel is looking great. Sand is low. Alright, so sand's low. Glass is decent, it's just under 200. So let's go ahead and get a second person there for the sand. We will also turn this on and do clay. I will get two people working that. So we'll start stockpiling a bit of clay. And then I would like to start making some bricks with the stacks burners. And I want to use those for homes, but also for our roads and whatnot. That's that's kind of what I've envisioned that to be a little bit more. Okay, how are our pastures doing? Oh, I, I like clicked this one over here for some reason. I forget why I was looking at this. Either way, this one is full, and the other one is full at 10. And this one is as well. So we're doing, we're doing well there. Looks like we're okay on the coats. Where do we have our clothing person now that's a school that's the market which i should probably get a second person work in that market just to make it nice and happy 
Um, there's a blacksmith shop, which I should probably build another one. Our limit is 400. It's doing well, but we're probably going to burn through some iron pretty quick. Where are you at? Where are you? You're the market. Okay. What are we building over here? We've got uh, barns, right? Yeah, yeah. Storage warehouse. Very good. We've got our chapel there as well. I've got the roads going around. That's good. Making a decent amount of food here. Okay, for the squash, though, we're doing fine. We're tinning it, I think. Um, yeah, squash, peaches, and meat. And then I built, that's right, I built the cherry and the peach brewery for when we get those going. Okay, looks like we're, we're good to go on the stacks burners. I'm going to set this one to not work. I'm going to set this one to be... Okay, never mind. That was wrong. Oh, it's not the stacks burner. It has to be the brickworks. It has to be brickworks. I messed that up. It's actually fine, though. Let's go ahead and upgrade this guy to brickworks. That takes lumber, clay, and stone. 40 stone, which I am actually out of. So how are we doing on our stone works? All right, this is where I could put some more people. Let's get this two more people working, the deep stone and salt mine. We are getting low on laborers, and our building queue is kind of growing a bit more and more, which, you know, that kind of sucks, but that's okay. We're doing candles out of beeswax. Now, we could get a butcher going and have the butcher... Oh, wait, I have jobs available? Did I already make the butcher? Well, I'll be. Um... Where were they, though? Now, they probably turned off like this. Okay, storage warehouse is done. That's good. Keep an eye on that. This warehouse is complete as well. I wanted to expand out this way. That's right. That's right. Sorry, that was my, oh, my wrist popping. Oh, that's right. The cow butcher here and the deer butcher over here because I've got the extra meat. I wanted to expand down here. I don't have enough people. Now, we did just get a few more laborers, which makes me think that we're going to have more people that need homes. Coke fuel... Um, whatevs. This is... I'm not even worried about that right now. I'm not even worried about trading right now because I don't have anything to trade. At least I don't feel like I have a good industry right now to do that with. So, that's kind of where we're at with that. Where are we at with clay? 110? Yeah, I should probably get one person working this here soon. I'll get the brickworks up here just to keep an eye on it. So, peach and squash and kale are getting sent over here. Which is over here and right there. So, I feel like... Are these full? Holy cow, they're full. My goodness. Wait, but these aren't producing anything yet. Oh, the peaches are. The cherries aren't because I, I killed that thing to get rid of that... Um, the infestation that we had. Okay, some of the stuff's starting to come back. Don't worry, guys. I'll remember. Uh, family's 47 homes. 39. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. I think I'm going to build up some more homes right along this road. Oh, that's right. I finished the mine over here, too. That's good. And town and boat is probably going to be what we want. Do I have a well? You know, it just shows how consistent I strive to be. When when I'm like, do I have the thing? And then I just I click on it. It's right there. I already have the, the well in. That's kind of funny. Um, I could probably now employ somebody here at the deer butcher and the cow butcher as well. But I don't really have a lot of extra storage. What I'm probably going to want to do is put a storage right next to this. So let's do that. You know, should I just do a... Well, no, I don't want to do a meat locker because I, the tallow won't get saved here. But what would that go under? What would tallow be saved under? Materials? It's probably materials. Plus, we've got this mine over here. Let's build a materials workshop. Or warehouse, excuse me. And then I want some kind of like, do I have like a meat locker? I do have a meat locker. Meat locker stores meat and meat products. Also includes nuts and fish. So I might not need this warehouse. But I'm I'm going to get this warehouse anyway because once we start producing out of the mine, the materials will go into there and that'll be good. Okay, the brick works. That's done. Let's go ahead and get the clay and furnace fuel going on that bad boy. I'll just say one person for now. <clears throat> set you over here and we'll take a we'll take a look at you here in a minute we'll take a gander this isn't going to be enough for the production we need just so you guys know oh we're going to get cherries this year that's nice that's real good okay that home was finished I'm going to go ahead and get the two butchers here one for cow one for deer start getting some good cuts out of that start getting some venison we can make additional candles from it as well which is good alright let's let this finish and then I want to look at the overview for town hall and see where we're at. Oh wait, we've got an infestation. That's what's going slow. Oh my gosh. 
Okay, squash. We're gonna do the same thing we did last time. Let's just kill it. There, it's done. Ugh. There we go. Um, and let me. I just. I just heard wifey up there. Let me check on her real quick. I'm gonna send her a message. But yeah, I. I don't know why I've never thought about doing it this way, but. Oh, it does pull a squash. Interesting. Huh. There we go. I sent her a quick little text. Anyway, let's see. Healing broth. That might be good to buy. Iron would be good to buy as well. What, okay, so what can I get for the 200 coke fuel? Again, as you guys, guys can see, I'm not I'm not pushing for trade very much yet, which is very different than I normally do. But I'm just I'm not pushing for it yet. So 100 healing broth, not brew. Let's call it brew. Yarg. It's the healing brew. Yarg, <laughs> heard. Um, let's put an additional person here in the stone mine. This is getting built up. I'm, I'm really happy about this. This is squash, right? Yeah, all these are squash. That's good. Happy that this is getting changed out. So squash. Oh, that's the one person that wasn't working. Okay. Okay. How much cherries are we getting? We're not done with that yet. Uh, materials warehouse is done. Meat locker will be completed soon. That's fantastic. You are making tallow, sausage, and beef cuts. I'm really tempted to put a market out here, but I'm probably going to wait just a little bit longer. Let's go ahead and do a dirt road just straight out from here so I don't build on it. So I've got three different areas I want to expand to right now. One is up here with, uh, we've put our, our storage barn up there, which I need to upgrade. Uh, one is down here, which we've already got some stuff working on, and the one is across the river. This way, which I've already built a bridge, so we've got a lot of actual growth. Overview, we still need about five more homes, so that's good. Um, what I'm probably going to do is let's go ahead and build two homes here, and then we'll come over here, and we'll build a couple homes out this way, and we'll just have them side, like across from each other. That way we can kind of prime the area. I don't normally do that, and I really should. You know, I've been thinking about that. I really, I really should do that. Only one person working this orchard. It seems to clear it well enough. It is autumn, and the weather's kind of mild, so we're probably, probably pushing our luck a little bit here. But hopefully, they'll come. And the the laborers will start coming to build. To build. Wow, <sighs> it's been a week, guys. It's been a week and a half of craziness. Um, the laborers will come and pick up this stuff. I saw them finishing off one of the farms, so. That's good to know. All right, how much how much brick do I have right now? 42, how much clay? 160? All right, we're doing okay. Why do I have so many jobs? Well, I just did four homes, <clears throat> didn't I? I don't have anything else building over here. Hey, look at that meat locker. Tallow, beef cuts, milk, good stuff. <clears throat> Excuse me. You know what, let's do a, a little market out here because I could do a milk uh, industry out here too for all the cattle that we have. So first, let's go ahead and get ourselves... I really like the small market, guys. I really, really like the small market. But why don't we make a little market of our own and do like a little fruit stall. You know, and let's pull it down this way a little bit. Oh, crud. Um, that is not wifey, but that is someone else that I definitely need to talk to here in a moment. Um, vegetable stall. Grain, silo, grain stuff. Do I have any grains? No, but I will. Crap. Alright, I'm going to pause the recording here. Sorry, guys. Okay, so short mini story random time. I'm back. Uh, <laughs> that was my in-laws. They don't live too far away. I just got a text about half an hour ago that uh, one of our family members passed away. Um, and that actually has nothing to do with what was going on with my family. Um, kind of an elderly person in our family passed away that was at the reunion that we were at the previous week so kind of odd um, but then they call me and the reason they call me twice is their power went out they asked for something apparently there's a power line like laying in the middle of the street somewhere in their neighborhood I don't know what's going on I advised them not to lick the power line so as always Nygos is here for nothing but solid advice so just Complete and utter randomness going on here. Jeez. Okay. Fruit stall, <laughs> vegetable stall, grain stall. 
Gosh, if it's not one thing, it's another. Um, protein stall. You know what I need to do? Okay, we've got our three guys right here, right? We got our, we got our fruit, our vegetable, and our, and our grain. Can I put something in the middle? To make like, I wanna, I wanna make like a shoe horse kind of thing going on here. Um, in fact, let's like just remove a bunch of these resources. I wanna see it. Let's get it opened. I should probably put some specialized warehouses over here while I'm thinking about it. How are we doing on stone? Gosh, stone's coming back. I did add two more people into there. I don't know why I'm still looking at the warehouse, except it's working, and it has a lot of crap in it. Good job, warehouse. All right, so here we go. We got these guys. Uh, what kind of what kind of decorative stuff can I do? I kind of had a native thing going on earlier, but... Um, native longhouse. A large longhouse traditionally made of wood, bark, or thatch. Or a combination of the three. Well then, there's a combination of the three. We got a lot of people coming uh, through school. They're going through the school to hard knocks. And, um... Should I do, like, a military thing? <sighs> I feel like I've never really done that. Besides the one where I did the... I did the, um... The big wall. I built the, the huge wall. Modular buildings? No. Oh, wait, there's modular. I forgot all about modular buildings. What am I looking for? I'm looking for, like, statues and stuff. Is it in here? Okay, it's in here. Never mind. I'm, I'm a complete dingus. Wooden horse statue requires a wooden horse. Weird. All of these require actual statues. Y you know what? Your making sense here is rude. Okay, let's just put a flag, like, somewhere. You know what? No, we're not doing it. I'm not doing it. We'll do it later. We'll do it live! Um... Okay, marketplace. We've gone all the way up to grain. Let's get uh, protein. We'll do that on this side. I had a good idea, and then I just abandoned it hardcore. Dried goods, clothing, and tools. My goodness. And materials. Materials stall with a materials warehouse over here? I think not. So, boom, boom, boom. Let's get three people working over there. Very nice. Everybody's going to be happy. we got Trader. I wonder if his name is Joe. No, his name is Leono. And you have a wood statue. Go figure. You get get out of here. You heard through the grapevine. We've got a spy in the mi in our midst. How are we doing on uh, brick again? Huh, 102. Oh, I've got to sneeze so bad. So yeah, basically, what just happened there has been like the majority of my life for the last little while. It's just been like, oh, there's a thing. Oh, it's not too bad. It's not too bad of a thing. And then it's like. Oh, by the way, there's another thing. Oh, okay, cool, cool. Oh, you're recording, you need to sneeze. Yeah, 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 great. So that's kind of been like my life for the last little bit. And I really should be more grateful because uh, things have things have panned out pretty well considering the circumstances. <laughs> it's just been kind of funny thinking about all that. You know, we, we were talking about modular homes here a minute ago. Why don't we just go ahead and throw one of these in? Level one, urban house, leaving space like it's 1972. All right, let's, uh, oh, I cannot fit you there. <gasps> Danger zone. Let's put a couple homes in there. One, two, three. And then we'll put a little gap. All right, so we're going to build those up. We're doing okay. How's our production? We're, we're doing okay on food still, but we're creeping up to our limit. Okay, those were built. Look at this. People just happy as, as clams over there. 49 families, 45 homes. Uh, those homes we're building down south. Those will help out. These guys filled in here as well. Mid-20s, 30s, and 20s? My goodness. It's almost like I planned it that way. The herb grower. Why are you max? Oh, because I brought all that. I, I bought the broth. The, the healing brew. I bought it. We got brick here, which... Are they laying it already? Oh, they're starting to. We're going to do a little zoom in. Look at, look at that. Look at how freaking fancy that is. That's that's an FF. Freaking fancy. That's really nice, night ghost. I'm really happy about that. Um, do we have enough room for everybody? Oh, we've got the college. Yeah, we're fine when it comes to schooling. And, oh, look at this. Cherries. Okay, I've got enough food. Here's what we're going to do. We are going to, we're going to make more squash because everyone is so happy to have all this squash. And we're going to start making cherry and peach ale. And I want to sell that stuff. Now, when you have the ale, you have to have somewhere to sell it in order for it to even get moved. So how about a small tavern? Right here, tucked away. Oh, it's the ale tavern it is. I don't know why I'm going with the accent here, but you know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna love life. We're just gonna enjoy it. 
right? Brickworks, what are you doing? 69, 69. That place is a fun place to be. All right, let's maybe up this to two people. No, I don't have enough. Look at those laborers. I need more people. Immigration policy, let them all in, make them work. I mean, it's kind of like a socialist atmosphere here. It's like, oh, you've been assigned a job. You are a, a street sweeper, or you grow herbs and you are an expert on mushrooms. You know, some people would be happy about that. Others would be kind of upset, but you know what, it's fine. <clears throat> I'm, I'm really kind of tempted to have like a whole militia military thing like I've I've dealt with the nomads and all this in a very uh, kind of nonchalant happy-go-lucky style you know it's like oh yeah sure come in to visit and everything's fine and I'm sure you're not gonna try and kill us or anything like that no it's like do do I need to be that way here let's turn that off for work because it's grains we don't have grains are we max on food <gasps> have you got our food limit oh my goodness if I put a one in front of that, the game will explode and it'll be great. Okay, cool. Before I move on to anything else, let's look at some other industries that we're not doing anything with. I think one is milk. Beef we're doing stuff with, but we could do more, I think. I think we could probably dry it. Okay, there's a small tavern. Let's get some money work in that. Little tavern right here. Look at that. They're already making ale. Fantastic. People's happiness are going to go through the roof until I start selling it all. Um, yeah, so there's that. So, milk. Where are you at, Milk? Um, tallow. We do need to start doing some stuff with Tallow. Got another trader again. Where's the milk? I also realized I'm not wearing my headphones, which I normally... Oh my gosh. I normally do when, um, when I'm recording, but I'm not this time around. Oh man, look at this. Fantastic. Let's go ahead and build some other homes here again. Wow, look at how low I am on laborers and whatnot. Uh, maybe... No, we will. We're gonna need more homes. Level two. Level two! And I didn't look at the trader, did I? We're gonna need to deal with milk. I, I didn't forget. Don't worry. Can I just do this? Can we just do like 200? Bam. 600 worth of something. Shimpi can pay. There you go, Shimpi. I should have got the pickled eggs. Delish, right? Um... Milk. Milk, milk, milk. Come over here. Go to production and refining. Okay, we have milking barns, which we can make even more milk by taking domesticated animals, which I don't know how many we have. I currently have five, and I'm not actually doing anything to gather more of them. <gasps> dun, 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 dun. Twelve nomads. Listen here. You guys are going to behave right. Look, they're, they're all in a cult. They're all in their own same clothing. We're going to allow you Please come and join the freaking commune or whatever. This is done. This one's not done yet. We're going to have to build a couple more homes, I think. This is good, though. I'm, I'm excited about that. Um, but milk. So we've got an oil press. There's the dairy parlor. I'm not going to do the parlors yet until we get into actually having all the domesticated animals, which I'm not sure I want to go into, honestly, for a while. So I'm going to get the old dairy. Oh, dairy here. Um, I wanted to do, like, farming and stuff over here. I guess I could still do that. We could leave the old dairy here, couldn't we? Yeah, because maybe we want to do some industrial stuff here with the mine. Gosh, I'm not sure. All right, whatever. Let's just build the old dairy. We'll have that bad boy there. All right. And that home was just finished, and a family moved in immediately. Let's go ahead and get the third floor going on up in here. Wait, second urban cap? Nope. There we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, I haven't been planning this out quite like I wanted to, except the farms are here, or the, the pastures are here, and then the milk stuff is here. So, that actually works out quite well. Same thing with the butchers. The deers are, the deer or whatever. I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to stress about that. But, you remember how I mentioned in the beginning that I wanted to kind of plan out areas and have them build up the way I want and, and kind of be a little more cohesive? This is kind of what I was thinking, but not, not quite exactly. I don't know what I was quite thinking. Protein stall's looking good. Veggie stall, of course, tinned vegetables. Do you have any tinned meat? Holy crap, I've got tinned meat. Um, leather, feather, tools, hide. Very nice. I think it's time for us to upgrade our, our smithing and all that, too. Which makes me think, oh, this mine is really going to be perfect, isn't it? Can I build a second one, though? That's actually a really good question. I can, and I should. I really should, because we could do the uh, we could do coal, we could get iron, and we could do like a whole big steel production over here. Oh, Alright, the old dairy. 
Let's get one person there, Dairy Dairy O'Terry working there, making some cheese and some some cream and some butter. Mmm, delish. How are we doing on food though? I feel like we're we're actually above what we were before, but are we okay? Yeah, we're fine. We we increased the output by about three thousand, or roughly three thousand, and our consumption went up by at least a thousand. So we're doing okay. Got more laborers. We've got a bunch of kids in school, or not in school, a bunch of little children, and then nineteen kids that are going to school. Look, it's like bees everywhere. Wait, an outbreak of what? Diphtheria. She's going to visit the doctor. <gasps> okay. I remember last time with the scarlet fever it freaked me out and everybody just rubbed herbs on their face and like didn't pray because we didn't have a, a cathedral because you know you apparently you need that to pray that was kind of a joke never mind is everybody gonna be okay there's two people they're sick i think both of them are here probably the nurse got sick or the, the physician go and get in there somebody at the mine got sick too Jeez. it's bad beeswax let's push you over to tallow for a bit the chandelry Okay, how, mu how much are we getting out of this a year? Just over 2,000? That's okay, just over 2,000. Okay, the mine's getting worked on over here. It's getting cleared up, I like that. Um, dairy's getting worked, I like that. I just need another, I need another barn. Look at that, that warehouse is completely full. I just need legit barns over here. Okay, so if, if that's the case, I'm gonna build two. Boom, boom, right there. Um, let's, let's get a, a well right next to the barn just in case i've got a trader pigs and leghorn now here's the thing i don't think we've done everything that we can yet with everything i haven't maximized our leather i don't think i've maxed out our beef which uh let's take a look at that real quick if i go in here is there's salting okay there's well there's a sugar house there's a smoke house all right hold on hold on here ladies and gentlemen <clears throat> We're gonna build ourselves a double smoker. No, oh. we are. Never mind. We're doing double smoker. If I'm gonna, if I'm gonna do more blacksmithing, I'll do it over here. This is gonna be pastures and whatnot. Reserve of stone is low. Yeah, you're darn right it is. Um, I think we're gonna remove everything out of here and build some pastures. I may even just go ahead and clear this, unless, of course, unless there's some really good mining areas here. Of course there are. Of course there are. Okay, that's fine. We'll do some pastures over here. I think I want to amp up my cattle production. I mentioned leaving these here. Um, I'm, I am going to leave that one there. I'm not going to put cattle there. But I mentioned leaving these here so that uh, we could bring in some other animals. You know what? I don't think I'm going to do that. I think what I'm going to do is say work by doing Frisian cows. Let's do a third. And we will split, not you, no. We've got to split one of these guys. You've got 10, you've got 15. Let's split the 15. They'll grow a little quicker. That's almost maxed, right? So we'll lose a little bit of production there in the short term. and the long term, it'll be good. You you actually do not need to be on. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Iron ore, one of you needs to be coal. So we've got a coal. I've got an iron ore. I like building these first and like setting what they should be so I don't forget. I do like that. So storage barn, What what's the what here? We need you to finish up. And I feel like some of the slowness here with building is the lack of uh, stockpiles. And I haven't addressed that at all. So let me go ahead and do that. I've got the materials, right? But I don't have anything else. I don't have our wood storage. I don't have stone storage at all. Um, iron. We're going to need all of these eventually for this area. Let's get some iron storage over here. And then maybe some fuel storage as well. Very good. All right, smokehouse. Let's take a look. We can make freaking beef jerky. Holy crap, we can. Um, venison cuts. We can make venison cuts as well. We need barrels. We need. We need all that stuff. Okay. So the barrels, smoked cheese, pemmican. All right. We have a whole freaking industry to work on. Now the logs are coming in over here. And I was tempted to move this out. I'm tempted to not now, and maybe wrap this around and just make this a double forested area, kind of a. A preserved reserve right and um, yeah we, we could just work with that so what I should do is the barrel stuff maybe should come over here you know we should do a road I should actually put down more brick roads let's do a road going over this way or something and oh that one little sliver of road you you all saw it you know you did jot mm, jaunt, jaunt, jaunted jaunted jaunt jaunt jaunted there we go Right out there. My brain is very much fried, and I do apologize. Um, 
I think we're getting behind on our tool production. If I'm if I'm looking at that correctly, we're dipping pretty hard. I need another mine or another uh, blacksmith. Okay, but hold on. Before, <laughs> before, before. Oh my gosh! Before I forget any of this stuff, we need to get this going. The Cooper, Cooper works barrels, crates, and all those necessities. So guess what? The Cooper, right over there. Probably mention this every time I look at the Cooper. I had a dog named Cooper. Miniature schnauzer. Love that thing. May your soul rest. Little dog. All right, we've got these doubled up. Let's go ahead and make sure one of those gets upgraded. I'm just, I'm just like throwing things, queuing them all up. I just, I just thought about something. Oh, right, blacksmith. Duh. All right, blacksmith shop. Um, let's go ahead and make sure we've got a road going over here. Very good. And then we will go blacksmith. And there we go. And really what I should be doing is like doubling up on a lot of this stuff. And I will pause one of these, right? Hold on. Tristany the tannery worker was pressed into tin cans, then distributed. What? thought it would be a relatively safe thing that was not an accident that was not a, who, who who's working here uh, uh no investigation needs to start who's freaking who no somebody's mad at somebody well they're not mad anymore tenry worker you listen here um somebody just got reassigned so dale has replaced tristany so it's not okay ma, ma america all right america here I see you. Daily? Not Dale. Dale? I don't know. And then Cameronlian. 82. Oh, gosh. You, you guys know an 82-year-old lady didn't do it. It was this guy, age 46. He did it. Tenery worker, educated. Yeah, he knew what he was doing. Clothing, fair. Tools, iron. This tell that guy's totally guilty. We're following him. You, you listen here, Merka. What are you doing? Working in that tinnery, cleaning up your, your mess, then going home. Yeah, I see what you're doing. What else do you do? That's all you do. He became obsessed. Oh, my gosh. Wait, where's he going? Oh, he's dropping stuff off. Okay, that's fine. Well, well, he's dead, so we're not going to stress about it. And there's some uh, mis mystery meat going on. That's kind of scary. Why don't we go ahead and buy some coats? Just for fun. Just for fun. That, I, okay, I need a lot. Coats are expensive, that's why I always do them. 40 coats, there you go, dismissed, very nice. <sighs> that was weird. I've had that happen one other, maybe two other times now, but one other time definitely, and it was on stream, and it was a really awkward, really awkward moment. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pause things here. I'm going to stitch these two videos together. Thank you, everybody, for hanging out. Thank you all for being here. I'm going to get this rock and roll, so I can get it out to you first thing tomorrow morning. Hopefully, I'll get that other video done as well. Thank you all for hanging out. <laughs> this has been fun again to jump back into and to kind of have some fresh eyes on it again. Um, it's been good. It's been good. So thank you all, and I will see you guys next time. Later.